What's going on, everybody? Spunky Nice Now, want to come to you guys with another video. So, the Eagles 2017 second round draft pick, cornerback Cindy Jones, um, the guy who most of us Eagle fans were super excited by drafting. We saw the potential in this kid. Um, been waiting for him to um, have a big breakout year. Of course, I made a video not too long ago about, you know, rather the, you know, the 2019 season, the year that he finally has his breakout year. But Eagle fans, you know, the majority of the fan base was was extremely happy when we draft this kid because we know the potential that he has based on what he did in college. But anyway, Sidney Jones was talking about, um, you know, his, you know, conditioning his body, you know, trying, you know, trying to condition his body, change his plan, you know, his workout routine, just try to stay healthy for the 2019 season. Here's what Sidney Jones had to say. Uh, I wanted to condition my body so I could just run, 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 and not have my muscles get fatigued. So that's where you get the um, the soft tissue injuries. I'm just I'm just trying to make my limbs prime to just to go to just go as long as possible. I felt like I looked pretty damn good for the first week. For myself, that's a big improvement, a big confidence booster. I'm just trying to build all the good things um, and trying to be consistent. Just trying to not even think about injury. So yeah, Sidney Jones speaking about just trying to get himself ready, man. Trying to, you know, trying to do everything he can to uh, prevent his body from getting injured again. Sidney Jones was a was a, was an absolute stud at um at you no know, for the Washington Huskies. He suffered that unfortunate um, Achilles injury. Um, he was a he was a projected first you no know, first round draft pick back in 2017. Suffered that unfortunate injury, and um, so far. He has not looked the same. You know, he has not looked the same as what he was in college. He's shown some flashes here and there of what he could be. You know, he's definitely shown some flashes, but he's been, so far in his NFL career, very inconsistent. But the good thing for Sidney Jones, time is on his side. He's still very, very young. He's only, what, 21? Excuse me, he's only, what, he was born in 1996. So, yeah, he's only, he's only 22, you know, 22, 23 years old. So he's still a very, very young guy, and time is on his side. But the clock is ticking, man. Eagle fans do you know Eagle fans. A lot of Eagle fans are starting to lose patience with him. Personally, I'm not. I have not. I have not lost patience in him yet. I still do believe in Sidney Jones. I still do believe that Sidney Jones could be something very good for us. Um, he's gonna have definitely. He's gonna have some um, competition with the with the emergence of um, Avante Maddox, Cravon LeBlanc. You know, um, <clears throat> he's definitely going to have some competition. That, that's for sure. But um, I am not giving up on Sidney Jones. You know, I, I am not fully giving up on him. I still do believe the kid um, can be something special for us. You know, just got just got to um, keep grinding out there, man. Got to stay healthy for one, you know. You know, he got hurt in the 2018 season as well. You know, just, you know ever since that college injury, you know, that, that pro day injury, he hasn't been the same. But I still, but I still have not thrown in the towel on Sidney Jones. I think, you know, I think he still can, um, he, he still can develop into a very, very good corner in the NFL. And I hope that's what the Philadelphia Eagles. So, whatever you gotta do, Sidney Jones, man, keep doing it, man. Do what you gotta do to, um, to get yourself in in the shape that you feel that you feel is necessary to be able to play and you know be able to play at a high level for the Eagles. Do what you gotta do, man. Hopefully it's working and um, you can go out there in 2019. And for those who are still doubting you, man, go out there and, and prove them wrong. Got to go out there on the field. You got to prove them wrong, man. Um, I, I still believe in you, man. I, I hope you can do it. You know, so, yeah, he's um he's doing everything he can you know, to, to um, get his body, you know, get his body ready for 2019. Let's hope, man, that 2019 is that year that he finally has that breakout year. And he shows that and he showed that that second round draft pick that we gave we gave for him in 2017 was not wasted because I hear a lot of Eagle fans say that that was a very wasted draft pick. Now, you no, know, the, the same Eagle fans who were super excited when, when the Eagles drafted him now they're saying that's a wasted draft pick. Hopefully, he goes out there in 2000 and, um, 2019 and shows that it was not a um, wasted draft pick and that it just took a little time for him to get it together. I hope he really does get together in 2019 because, you know, I I, I want to see Sidney Jones in the Eagles Midnight Green for a very, very long time, possibly his whole career. I want to see him in Eagles Green. 
I still do believe that he can. Re I still do believe that he can return back to the player that he was in college. I, I, I honestly do feel that way, man. But like I said, he has a little uphill back climb right now. You look at the Eagles' depth chart right now at corner. <clears throat> of course, you got Jalen Mills. You got Ronald Darby. Darby. You got um, Craven LeBlanc, who came out of nowhere last year. Same thing with Avante Maddox. You got um, Rasua Douglas, his 2017 draft mate. Um, you got you got Iggis over there as well. So right now, that depth chart is pretty full at in, no, at corner. So he's definitely gonna have a pretty uphill. He's gonna have an uphill battle, but I hope he goes out there and he wins that battle, man. And I, I, I'm, I'm definitely cheering for Sidney Jones. I definitely still feel like he definitely can um, be a great player for us. And like I said, man, I hope he does. I absolutely hope he does because he plays well. He goes back to what he was at college. Look out the rest of the of the, look out the rest of the NFL, man. We have a stud corner there, a stud shutdown corner because you go back and look at what he did in college, man. The kid was a shutdown corner, a legitimate shutdown corner. He returns back to that man. Look out the rest of the NFL, man. We got we got we got a stud corner. But only time will tell if he if he's able to get back to that form. You know, only time is gonna tell on that. But I'm 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 one of those Eagle fans, like I said, that has not given up on Sidney Jones. I still do believe in Sidney Jones, and I do believe that he and I do believe that he his determination, his hunger, his drive, I think it's gonna pay off. I honestly do think it's gonna pay off. You know, I I I, I honestly do feel like it's gonna feel like it's gonna pay off. But you guys let me know what you think in the comment section. Um have you given up on Sidney Jones? Let me know if you have. Let me know if you have not. Uh, <clears throat> um just let me know what you guys think in the comment section. I'm still pulling for you, Sidney man. I still believe in you and I think you will in 2019. You're gonna have that breakout year. You're gonna have that breakout year and you're gonna prove the doubt is wrong. I honestly do feel that way. But you guys let me know what you think in the comment section. As always, go birds. Spunky Nice 9-1 is out of here. Fly, Eagle, fly. Peace.